We visited the area where these shutoffs are taking place, and quite a few residents are curious to know as to why now. We're either not going to have water or have to boil it through the entire holiday and weekend. Hemlock homeowner Deborah McLeod is anxious about her Thanksgiving holiday. After receiving this notice, warning her and several other residents along Wilson Street about an impending water shutoff earlier this morning. It then says over the next two days, a boil water advisory will be in effect. But McLeod believes that this was a rather inconsiderate way of addressing such a serious issue right before the holiday. Yesterday I came home about six o'clock and um, it was, you know, stashed in my door um, that, yeah, here, you know, surprise. So TV5 took our tough questions to the Saginaw County Public Works Commissioner, Brian Windling, who says the reason it's happening now is because of the nearby school district, saying the school expressed that they were very capable and willing to operate during a recommended water boil, however would not be allowed to operate during a shutoff. Although an inconvenience for many homeowners, everyone involved in providing input felt that this would be far less of an inconvenience than to impact the entire Hemlock School District. Windling also expressed sympathy for McLeod and her situation, saying this was a decision not taken lightly and only in conjunction with the township and school officials. But McLeod still thinks more should have been done to avoid the inconvenience for her neighborhood. It's 30 families, yeah, I get that. Maybe it's a small number to them, but we're 30 families that matter. And we received word from the commissioner saying the water shutoff has ended and that the area will be in a boil water advisory until further notice. Reporting live in the newsroom, Jonathan Jackson, WNEM TV 5.